Hello guys! I've never done one of these what I wore this week videos so I thought why not try it out this week? Maybe it will be a success and if you guys really like these kind of videos maybe it should be something that I do a couple of times each month. So today is Saturday and we are on our way out. We are going to the mall. Yay! I am gonna go pick up some of my absolute favorite concealer um, and that's the only place that I can get that concealer so that's what we're doing today and then later we're gonna go out to have a bite to eat so maybe I'll show you my outfit there as well. So what I'm wearing today is actually rather I guess you could say kind of a spring outfit. Um, definitely not warm enough to be wearing outside but since we're gonna be walking around inside of a mall I thought this is perfect because then I can keep my coat and every everything on um, without sweating off my butt. So what I'm wearing is my trusty and other story sneakers. I've had these for around three years and they're still going strong. They could definitely need a good round of cleaning soon. Then I'm wearing my black straight leg jeans from Dr. Denim. I bought these on ASOS and they're my absolute favorite black jeans. Then I'm wearing this old H&M Premium Merino wool knit as well. Just a really soft and thin, very nice uh, jumper. I don't wear it enough actually, but it's also just because it's not really warm enough to be wearing during winter. And then I'm wearing my Everlane trench coat, which... And then I'm wearing my Everlane trench coat, which I was gifted back in December and I've just been dying to start wearing this coat. I love it. I love the crisp fabric. I love this slightly oversized fit. Then I decided to go for this brown vintage handbag as well, which I haven't been wearing in a while, but I really still love this bag. I love how exclusive it makes my outfits look. So there is the full look of today. Oh yeah, and then my necklaces. These are from a Scandinavian brand called Glitter. They made this um, gold-plated sterling silver collection at some point. I'm not sure you can still get these, but I'm gonna make sure to link some similar ones down below because I found a lot of uh, similar ones on Etsy, also along with a lot of other great jewelry. So I'll make sure to link everything down below. Hey guys, so it is now Saturday night and we are going to dinner. So it's a date night. We're going to eat at a Italian restaurant. Um, so I quickly changed my outfit. I kind of just redid my hair a bit, just curled a few random strands and I did my makeup again, applied a bit of brown eyeshadow and just refreshed my base. But other than that, not really anything special. I like it quick and simple. So um, let me just show you what I am wearing. And actually, before I show you the entire outfit, I want to show you a trick. Um, I usually like to wear my blazers like this, just kind of have the sleeved ruched up. Um, and the reason why I like this, especially because then I can show off my golden jewelry. I learned this from Emma Hill because I follow her on YouTube and I saw her doing it and I thought, you know what, I'm gonna try it and it works really well. So let me just show you this trick. So I'm just gonna put you, gonna put you here. And I hope you're able to see what I do. So what I have here is an elastic band and I just place it right here on the sleeve. And then I take off the sleeve like this and then fold it over. And that is just gonna make sure that the sleeves stay in place like this. It doesn't slide down as if you didn't wear the elastic band at all. So I think that is pretty cool and um, yeah, great way to keep the sleeves in place. So let me just show you the full outfit. I decided to just keep on the black jeans that I wore earlier today as well. And then I have put on these trusty old acne studio boots that I bought secondhand ages ago. I think they're, they must be around like five to six years old now and they're still going strong. I love the bo these boots so much. And then I decided to just go for this bag again because I really, like I said earlier, like this golden chain and especially for a nighttime look like this, I just think it makes it look look a lot more exclusive. Then I am wearing my and other stories belt. I'm wearing all my golden jewelry, um, my Daniel Wellington watch and bracelet, my necklaces that I also showed you earlier. This tiny 
bracelet is from Norfolk's, which is a sustainable jewelry brand. And I actually can't really remember where this one is from. Um, and then I have all of these hoops in my ears as well. So sort of just blinged up this very basic look. Then I'm wearing this lace cami. Oh, hi. Hi. And then my Everlane blazer. Oh, the light just changed. Sorry about that. So yeah, that's the look for tonight. Just very simple and very me, very comfy and uh, very dinner date night appropriate. So I'm just gonna wear my second hand and other stories coat on top of the outfit and then wrap a big old scarf around my neck and then I hope I will be warm enough to walk from the car to the restaurant. Good morning guys, so today is Sunday and um, as you know if you've been following me for a while Sundays are pretty holy for us, that's when we um, get ready for the next week so we're gonna go grocery shopping and um, normally I wear something really comfortable on Sundays. I actually might even just wear sweats, but because we're gonna go grocery shopping and because I am planning on writing a few posts for next week on the blog and taking a few pictures, I want it to look a bit more presentable. So um, not wearing anything groundbreaking at all, just went for something very comfortable. So put my hair up in a nice quick bun and um, then I am wearing my jeans from Mango. These are old. I don't even know what the fit is called. I am wearing my Dr. Martens boots. Obviously, I'm not wearing these inside. I'm just wearing them now because we're going to head out the door very soon. Um, and then I'm wearing my People Tree striped jumper. I love this jumper. Every time I'm kind of in a rush or if I want to look nice very quickly and don't want to think too much about what I'm wearing, this is what I go for. And uh, yeah, then I've put on all of my jewelry. Normally, like I said, if I'm just wearing sweats or if I'm wearing a sweatshirt and a pair of jeans, I wouldn't put on my jewelry at all because I'm that kind of person that when I come home from work, the first thing I do is take off all my jewelry. I don't know what it is, but so just showing you the outfit with my trusty wool coat. This one is from a brand called Ichi. And um, yeah, that's what we're dealing with today. Good morning, guys. So today it is Monday and I always work from home on Mondays. Um, as you know, if you've been following me for a while, I work half the time as an influencer and the other half I have an actual job at an office. Um, so I'm a social media assistant for a Danish women's wear brand. But yeah, like I said, today I'm working from home and whenever I work from home, I always try to get up and get dressed like I would any other day if I was going to the office, just because I think I'm a bit more effective and I get more shit done when I do this instead of just hanging around in my sweats all day. Also, I often film some things, I take some pictures, so I don't really want you guys to only see me in sweats, obviously. So, um, so let me just show you the full look. Now, obviously I'm wearing boots right now, but I am not wearing these since I am just at home. But if I was going to the office, this is how I would style this look. I would also bring my huge shovel bag with me just because I can fit a lot of crap into this bag. So yeah, this is the full look and um, feeling kind of springy even though it is indeed still winter in Denmark. Um, haven't worn this blazer for quite a while but uh, this is actually one of my absolute favorite blazers. I've been keeping it in my wardrobe for the past three years. So this blazer is from Justice, a Scandinavian Danish brand actually. And then I'm wearing this super old gray t-shirt from another Danish brand called uh, Only. A lot of you have actually been asking me lately how I make sure to find great quality t-shirts. And this is actually kind of a tricky thing. Um, and it's something that I, I haven't completely cracked that myself yet, but if it's something you want me to do a video about, let me know because I would love to help you guys finding um, great t-shirts with a great fit, a great quality, especially when it comes to white t-shirts. I know that a lot of you are concerned whether it's too see-through or not, so let me know if that's something you want me to do because I'd be glad to kind of um, explore that world and that area for you guys. Um, so then besides that, I'm wearing my glitter necklaces, 
wearing the same old um, style of earrings, the same uh, jewelry on my wrists, my Daniel Wellington watch and bracelet, and then this um, Norfolk's tiny bracelet right here, which is a sustainable jewelry brand, um, also Scandinavian. Gotta love those Scandinavian brands. Um, then I'm wearing these vintage Levi's jeans, which I've bought on ASOS Marketplace. Uh, then I'm wearing my Acne Jensen boots, and these are secondhand. And then my Adax shopper bag. Oh, I always seem to have trouble catching my breath when I do these videos. I don't really know why. Maybe it's because I've been taking on my boots or putting on a jacket or I don't really know. But yeah, that's what we're dealing with today. Monday. Let's do this. Hello guys, so today is Tuesday. I just got home from the office and um, yeah, let's have a look at today's outfit. I am wearing this outfit right here, um, pretty black and then I've just broken out the black with my brown boots and my long secondhand camel coat from And Other Stories. Um, so nothing really groundbreaking about this outfit. I just needed to get uh, dressed quickly this morning. I didn't really want to think much about it. And I think that's one of the beauties with having a capsule wardrobe is that you have so many possibilities of just throwing something on without even thinking about it and it's still gonna work magic. So I actually felt really comfortable in today's outfit. I am wearing this secondhand uh, roll neck jumper. It's from a few years back. And then I'm wearing my black Dr. Denim jeans that you also saw, I think it was on Saturday this week, earlier this week. Um, and then I'm wearing this coat, as I said, and then my brown boots from um, a Danish brand called Bianco. These were also a secondhand purchase. Hey, shuddy. So yeah, that is today's outfit. Um, don't really have anything in particular to say about this outfit other than it being really comfortable. Actually, let me just show you the outfit without the coat on because obviously I don't wear the coat inside while I'm at work. So here is the outfit without the coat. Um, nothing highly fashionable about this outfit. It's just a basic jumper, a pair of jeans and a pair of boots. But this is nonetheless what I've been living in the past many weeks and all throughout winter actually. So that is today's outfit. Good morning guys. I really hope that you can see something. I've turned up the exposure on the camera pretty much because it's still dark outside. I am on my way to work. Normally I don't work on Wednesdays but we've had to switch around a couple of days this week because of some events going on at the office. So I'm going in to work today and then I'll be home tomorrow and on Friday as well. So I thought I just wanted to show you today's outfit and as always I am losing my breath. I don't know <laughs> what it is. I think maybe because I'm running around and then it's still early. I don't know. So well let me just yeah I think that's better. So here is the full look of today. I am wearing my vintage check blazer, which I bought on ASOS Marketplace. And I'm wearing this super old white crew neck t-shirt, just a basic t-shirt from a Danish brand called Only. This is the one that I revamped with this little love print right here. If you saw the video called how to revamp an old t-shirt, you might have seen the tutorial on how I did that. Then I'm wearing my vintage Levi's 501 jeans as well. These are also found on ASOS Marketplace. And then I'm wearing my secondhand Acne Studio boots. These are the model called Alma. I don't think they make them anymore, but I've always really loved this boot. And then, of course, my trusty black shopper bag from the Danish brand Adax. So that is the look I'm going for today. And then lately I've been kind of doing my hair this way. Um, I find that now that it's getting a bit longer, I just, I find it easier to, to curl in the morning. This might look like it took a lot of time to do, but it actually only takes around, I think, seven minutes to curl it like this, because as you know, I don't curl my entire hair. I just curl a couple of few, a couple of few. I just curl a few random strands, and then I put in some wax or a little bit of hairspray. Um, and also I don't wash my hair every day, so, it's really easy to make this very 
wavy, messy beach wave kind of hair do. So yeah, I am off to work now and I will be back tomorrow with Thursday's look. Hello guys, so today is Thursday. I am home again at my home office and working here all day. Um, I'm feeling a little bit ill today. So um, this is not exactly what I'm wearing today. Actually, I was just wearing something really cozy. And I do think that I'm gonna change back to sweats because like I said, I'm not feeling very well today. I don't know if it's because I didn't sleep very well last night or what it is, but I just need to chill for the rest of the day. And it's 1.30 now, so <laughs> the entire day is basically already gone. Um, but I just filmed some footage with this outfit this t-shirt is DIY and it will be up on my channel on Sunday. So if you want to see how I made this t-shirt, stay tuned for that video. Um, if you watched my spring capsule video part one, the one where I kind of go over all the things that I'm inspired by at the moment and what kind of looks I'm lusting over, you will know that lace and kitten heels together with a pair of jeans is just really high on my wish list for looks that I'm gonna go for this spring. So yeah, this is gonna be me all spring. Just saying, be prepared. I'm wearing this Justice t-shirt with the lace trim and then the same old jewelry that I've been wearing all the other days. My vintage Levi's jeans and vintage heels also, both of these are from ASOS Marketplace. Um, so yeah, kind of cheating a bit today. I'm not really wearing this, but I'm showing you this. That's the thing when you work as a blogger, sometimes you show some outfits just for the inspiration of it, uh, but it doesn't mean that you necessarily wear that on the particular day. I do try to um, be as authentic about that as possible, but at the same time, I am a capsule wardrobe blogger and I really want to show you different ways of styling a minimal closet. So even though I might not be wearing that on the particular day, I would be wearing it some other day. So yeah, this is today's, today's look. Hello guys, so today is Friday. This is the last day I will do this, what I wore this week, because I have to finish the editing of this video and then I will go live later today. You might remember that yesterday I told you that I didn't really feel very well and I do feel a bit more like myself today, but still not completely over this feeling ill. I really hoped that I would sleep like a baby last night, but I just didn't have a really pleasant night. I had so many things running around in my head and I just didn't feel very good. <coughs> so I might need to take a nap later today or maybe just crawl into bed early tonight. Also, my mom is struggling a bit with her health at the moment, so I just had a lot of things going on on my mind. Oh, yeah, do feel a little bit better today, but um, I just probably need a couple more days. So I'll be drinking lots of hot water with lemon and ginger because I just don't have the time for it. Um, so right now it is 15 to 10 and I'm on my way to the local supermarket to just do a little bit of grocery shopping before um, in a couple of hours I'm gonna be paid a visit by a student from the design school in a city near where we live. Um, she is writing a project about sustainable fashion and she's gonna interview me about the capsule wardrobe system. So I am pretty excited for her to come. Yeah, so let's have a look at today's outfit. Let's start with the jewelry because I actually have something new going on here. Yesterday I received this necklace right here. Um, this is a bubble chain with a golden horn necklace and uh, these are 14 karat gold filled jewelry. So they are not solid gold, but they are transfer proof. So the gold will stay on. Definitely one of my best tips for golden jewelry, go for at least solid gold or gold filled and at least 14 karat because it just looks better. It's not as yellow and it just, yeah, it will stay nice for a really long time. Um, and then I'm wearing my disc necklaces as I always do. I think this combo looks really cute. Then I have put on my Comme des Garçons uh, striped top. I haven't worn this in a while. And then these old tailored trousers from H&M. My leather jacket and then a pair of sneakers. So uh, yeah, that is today's look and uh, just super comfortable. 
So I'm gonna wrap up this what I wore this week video right here. If you guys really enjoyed this video and if it's something you would like me to do maybe once or twice a month, let me know in the comments down below because I would love to do and make whatever content you guys like. And uh, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. On Sunday, the video with the lace top that I showed you yesterday will go live. And then next week, I will have another spring capsule wardrobe video coming for you. Today on my blog, I actually have a post about how to care for your wardrobe before a new season starts. Um, so if you want to check out that post, head over to my blog. The link is in the description box. Um, so yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Have a wonderful weekend and I will see you soon. Bye.